hello and welcome back to my channel today i decided to do a massive haul this was like christmas stuff anything that i've gotten really well i've been in massachusetts is in this haul so minus a few things because you know i'm scatterbrained i can't remember everything but i have a lot of things here to show you and i never did a christmas haul so why not so i'm gonna get right into it actually pause for a second if you're new to my channel I'm Allie I have a bunch of other videos as well and I like to lately I've been posting a lot more frequently um so yeah just subscribe if you want to see more videos that was the most awkward intro ever oh well okay so right into this haul so first off this was a Christmas present it was in my stocking and it had a pen in it with my name on it but I took the pen out so it's not here but I have the box from it so I figured I would show you the box just to, you know my dad for Christmas got me this watch this is an Invicta watch like look how teeny tiny that is I just got it sized so now I can actually wear it and I'm gonna wear it today but I'm not wearing it right now for the purpose of this video but it just looks like this and this unscrews like this and there's a bunch of other ones that you can put on it that are different colors so um and it's water resistant yeah so um we'll start right here so i got this north face it was given to me by a friend, and it's a North Face. It is covered in dog hair. I'm so sorry. But it's this North Face, and it's hooded, and it just looks like this. And I wear it all the time because it's cold here, and that's like lightweight but warm. And then next, I got this journal, and I just got it for journaling and stuff because this year is going to be a big year for me. So I figured, why not keep track of it? You know, and I'm gonna go kind of quickly through this stuff. I got this face wash system. I talked about it in a favorites video, um, my January favorites for 2017. So if you want more about this, go watch that video. Okay. So when I came here, I didn't bring any makeup. I wasn't planning on staying that long, so I didn't bring any makeup. Or I brought like a couple of things, but I didn't bring like really anything. And so I had to kind of restock when I got here. So there's kind of a lot. And then I lost makeup too. So first off, I have the Rock Nudes, which was also in a, these were in a favorites. The Rock Nudes and the Nudes palette by Maybelline. I want the 24 karat one in the um, rose gold one. And then I got this. The Natural Glam Eyeshadow and Baked Highlighter by Style Essentials, and it just looks like Isaiah. It's, it's pretty good. I highly recommend. I got this Burt's Bees. It came in like a pack. This is cotton gloves, and you're supposed to put like the hand stuff on. Um, it also came with this Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream, and then there's a hand balm that's in my bathroom as well. So this actually smells so good it smells like lemon meringue pie it's delicious so i'm gonna put that there um i got the brow kit by maybelline so it comes with a brow define and fill duo and the brow drama sculpting brow mascara and i'm in soft blonde or soft brown soft brown um i got two maybelline line express eyeliners Sorry, I'm like digging through this. And I also got a beauty blender that needs to be cleaned. Yeah, so I'm just gonna put this stuff back in the makeup bag so that I don't lose it. Yeah, buddy. I don't know where I'm gonna put this makeup bag. Put it there. Okay. Also, I got this. Towel from San Cloud Towels. I had originally made a video that I never posted on it, but it's like just big and it's awesome and I will be bringing this to Florida with me. 
that has like a pocket for your like cell phone and stuff tassels and I got I think it's like the Luna tie-dye or something um but if you want I'm like 25% off I'll leave a coupon code down below for St. Cloud towels yeah so this I had gotten for myself these are just resistance bands for working out so there will be a lot of like equipment working out wise so there's three different like strength um, weights resistance no um, I believe this is the heaviest so this is medium and then this is the um, least Okay, so next, my grandmother is starting every Christmas. She's giving me one of these. This year, she gave me two to start it off, but this is the covered bridge. These are like the um, things that you make the Christmas scenes with, which will be awesome because when I'm older, I can have a nice little Christmas village, which I'm, ex I'm excited for. And then this came in my stocking. It's like a little like um, container type of plate thing that'll be nice for like jewelry and stuff when I have my own bedroom and place and stuff so that's why it's not opened yet and then this is the actual Christmas village thing that she gave me it is the Collie Weston post office it says the English post office was a mainstay of communications in Victorian England a familiar expression post haste derives from this period it was common to admonish the courier to keep up his pace by writing haste post haste on the outside of a letter hurry to this attractive post office to get your letter mailbox time and this one lights up, I'm pretty sure. And so, yeah. So we build in that village. Okay. Next, I got this Michael Kors bag. Um, this is also my What's My Purse video, so I'm not going to get too much into this. So, and then there's a couple things in here that I got. So first I have The Silence of Six, which I finished and I love and I want to read the second book. And then I Hunt Killers, which I'm in the middle of. So I'm not going to say anything about it. And then I, I'm going to show you this because I'm filming on it, but I got the iPhone 7 as well. So yeah, I got that recently because my phone like glitched and we thought it was broken and then a couple days later it started back up, but I decided to keep the thing. So also for Christmas, I got this stocking and it's a nutcracker stocking and I used to hardcore collect nutcrackers I would get one every single year. So this is kind of cute and um, something that is very me. Okay, so back in to the workout gear. I have a different type of resistance bands. These are the um, like rope ones and you can connect handles to them. I broke the black one though. I like snapped right off. These are just cheap ones from Walmart so I'm not surprised really. But um, yeah, so I have those. Um, I got one of these TRX things, which I absolutely love this thing. It's like one of my most favorite things. And you like, all of this stuff is from Gold's Gym, the brand, and from Walmart. So you just hang it over your door and shut the door. And then you have like these and you can do a ton of ab workouts and stuff and core stuff. So I love that. And then I have a couple different variations of dumbbells, but I'm only going to show you this one the other one is by gold gym as well and it has interchangeable things so you can change the weight of the dumbbells and then these are just the 10 pound ones these ones are by daily burn they're just metal yeah all right now we're going to get into clothes which is the last section of this haul so first off i have this hat it's a harvard hat i went to boston to go to the harvard art museum and this hat is in horrible condition i do not it was in my drawer, I'm gonna have to fix that. Oh my God, that's really frustrating. Look at that brim. It's like, I'm gonna have to figure out a way to fix that. I'm gonna take that out, leave that out of the thing. So my aunt gave me this dress cause it didn't fit her, it was too 
like tight on her and body fitting and she didn't like that and so it's by one clothing it's a medium so it's just black and white striped it fits me in like a t-shirt dress so if you were wondering and then i got this dress from forever 21 and i wore this for thanksgiving it's just a crushed velvet dress and it's long sleeve and it's just so cute burgundy and i will definitely get a ton of use out of it um, I got these black jeans specifically for work. They came from Marshalls. And then my grandma washed them for me, which was so nice for her, but she must have gotten like bleach or something on them because there's been a stain on them ever since. I wasn't there when I gave them to her. And these are by Can Can, K A N C A N, I think. And these smell like Zorbas, and I can't wear them anywhere because they smell like the restaurant no matter how many times I wash them. And then I got these Victoria's Secret um, sports yoga pants. These are Victoria's Secret sports. So they're just army green. They're full length. They have kind of like um, compression, like outlining and stuff. And they have pockets, which is one of my favorite things about them. And I got these for myself when I was Black Friday shopping. And then I have got this sweater from my mom's friend. She was giving away some clothing. This is by the brand Worthington. And it just has like a mock neck. And it's just navy. And it's comfy and nice. And then my grandma for Christmas got me this black sweater. It has three quarter length sleeves. It's a v-neck. And it's not like super long or super short. It's the perfect length, which is awesome. And then I got these two shirts from Wet Seal, and they're both the same. They have the, like, lacing up the front, and this one says Current Mood, and it's in, like, a grayish blue color. And then this one says Babe, and it's in a burgundy. Sorry, it's so wrinkly. And then from Marshalls, I got this top by Japna. It's inside out, um, but I'm just I'm just gonna read it, and it's just like a high neck um, with crochet sleeve details, cap sleeves, and then an open back. And I tend to not wear a bra with it, but it's like super cute, and I love it. And then from Walmart, I just got a couple like normal tank tops. They fit across the front. I also got a black one. I mean, a white one. So I got teal, red, army green, and a white one. And then I got these because these were on sale, and I'm not a huge fan of these because these are like see-through. They're like that like stretchy neoprene material, but they were a dollar. And these are by No Boundaries, and they're just teal. And I'm not a huge color person either for pants, so yeah. And then I also got these ones, which are my favorite. They're just the cotton ones from Walmart. I'm wearing them today, I wear them all the time, except the ones I'm wearing today are in black. And these are just hot pink, and I got them for the purpose of working out. And then for Christmas, my mom got me these pants by 90 degree. Hold on, they're inside out. I don't know why I'm turning this inside right though. It doesn't really matter all that much. And they're just black, and then they have like black and white detailing like stripes down the side. And they have pockets as well. And that's why she kind of got them for me too. They're high waisted too. So, yeah. And then I got some tights. Nah, sorry I got some tights just for that dress for Thanksgiving and then I have I got this sports bra which is like a black and white and gray zebra textured print and it like crisscrosses in the back this is my favorite sports bra almost all my sports bras are from Walmart except for the one that I'm about to show you this is from Dix this is an Adidas one and it's just white I got it on Black Friday and then the last thing that I have to show you is this sports bra and it's it says breathe on it and it was just on sale at Walmart it's teal and pink and yeah so if you guys want more haul like videos thumbs this video up um and I decided that I was gonna start vlogging more because I had fun with it yesterday so you will be seeing this video today and you will also be seeing a vlog and I think I'm gonna try to daily vlog and we'll see how it goes because I kind of had fun with it 
So along with normal videos, you'll get to see some daily vlogs. And I am so sorry this video is so long. Oh my gosh, I forgot a few things that I recently got from the Salvation Army. That still needs to be washed. So I got these all in the men's section, except one of these doesn't look like it's a men's thing. So this is a like oversized sweatshirt and it just says Red Sox on it because I'm from Mass. So it's just gray. This was $3.99 and this is by the brand Wright and Dixon. So just love that. And then I got this sweatshirt, which is was $2.99, and it says Niagara Falls, Canada, and the has a maple leaf, but it has like a design in the maple leaf, and it just looks super cozy, and kind of smells musty, definitely needs to be washed. And then I got this, just for like lounging around for bed and stuff, and it's a plaid, red, white, and blue plaid from the brand J. Crew, and it was $2.50 for this, and... It's a size extra large, so it's huge because it's also in men's. So yeah, that is it. Please subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys all in my next one. Bye!